My friends, greetings to you once more. As I'm sure you have heard by now, Madam Halima Yaakob is the only person who is eligible to stand as a candidate in this year's presidential election. As such, tomorrow on nomination day, she will be the next president of our country. So, it is with great sadness in my heart that I must inform you that my journey as the candidate in this year's presidential election has now come to an end. I had been informed yesterday by the Presidential Election Committee that my application to stand as a presidential candidate in this year's election had been rejected. I was informed that this was because uh, I did not fulfill the requirement of having a private limited company with an annual turnover of $500 million. Now it's true that uh, my company does not have an annual turnover of $500 million, but I had hope that they would grant me a waiver as they did uh, in the previous uh, presidential election for one of the candidates. You know, I'm a director of a chain of uh, high-end batik stores in uh, Juchiat and uh, Geylang Serai. Uh, but, uh, you know, I had, in, I had told the presidential election committee, the PEC, that I had built this business to what it is today, you know. But, however, their reply was that, oh, uh, you know, based on the nature and complexity of uh, your business, uh, we don't feel that uh, it would be justified if we waive the requirement of uh, your company having the annual turnover of $500 million. Well, basically what they were saying was that uh, they didn't think my company was uh, complex enough lah, to justify waiving the requirement. Well, what to do? Lah? I mean, I am disappointed to say the least. And, uh, you know, some of my friends and supporters have also expressed, you know, their sadness and disappointment. One of them even said to me, Oh, Mr. Man, you know, you are the best president that we never had, that Singapore never had. Well, I mean, well, I'm moved and touched by what he said, but I mean, I don't know lah about being the best and all that. I mean, I would have done my best had I been elected, no doubt about that, but be the best, well, I don't know lah. We'll just leave it at that lah. To those of you who have supported me, encouraged me all this while, I would like to convey to you my how sorry I am, you know. I mean, I did my best, but sadly, I came up short. The fault is mine, and I'm very, very sorry. So, do I regret any of this? No, my friends. Not for a single moment do I regret doing any of this. You see, when you stand up for a cause that you believe in, it gives you purpose and it gives you meaning, okay? Now, running for president is the biggest thing that I've ever done in my life. And you know, and with your support and your encouragement, you know, I was able to find the fortitude and character, you know, to take the, this big step in a bit to try and serve my country, you know. And that is something I will take away with me and I thank you from the bottom of my heart for. So, what will I do from here? What will I do now? Well, I haven't decided yet what I will do, you know. I think I will have, I will have to sit down long and hard and think about, you know, all these things. And I, I shall also be discussing this matter with my wife, Mrs. Man. Uh, she has been very supportive of my political aspirations, but uh, I think now she would like it if uh, I were to concentrate on our business. Like I say, you know, our no, our business uh, is in the high end. Uh, you know, our business, yeah. In case you are wondering, is called Man and Mon. Uh, okay, Mrs. Man's given name is uh, Mona, so we shorten it to Mon uh, because Man and Mon sounds very nice. And also at the same time, it sounds elegant and easy to remember. Ah, so uh, you know, we sell uh, men's uh, high-end, you know, men's uh, batik shirts and uh, 
women's dresses also. In fact, what I'm wearing now is uh, something from my shop. You know, it's uh, from Chirbon, the pattern and uh, this thing. You will not find it anywhere other than at Man and Moon. Okay. Uh, and for, you know, we also have uh, sell suit jackets made from Bate. Yeah, yeah. We also have Nehru jackets or Mandarin collars. And for women, ah, uh, you know, Mrs. Man can design for you a Chinese Chong Sam or Indian Sari. Yeah, yeah, my wife is very artistic and creative. And she's also a very good businesswoman. That is why I promoted her from general worker all the way to become a director of my company. Why? Because I practice meritocracy. Ah. I mean, I told all this to, you know, the PEC, but I don't know. Lah. I don't think they believe me. So what to do? So anyway, if you're ever in uh, you know Geylang Serai or in Juchet, please uh, do come to our shop and look for me and Mrs. Man, okay? Uh, and uh, also, before I finish, you know, before I end this uh, video, I would like to express and extend my congratulations to Madam Halima Yaakob, okay? I believe uh, as a president and as our head of state, she deserves our respect and our support. Eh, I mean, uh, she did win the position lawfully and democratically. Okay, and also remember, she is a president for everyone, not just the Malays. <laughs> okay, and before I sign off, uh, please uh, remember to hit click and uh, sorry, to, uh, please remember to hit the like and the subscribe buttons. Uh, you know, uh, below at the links. And also, please do let me have your comments on this video. Mm. Okay, my friends. Thank you very much for all your support and encouragement and may God bless you.